Welcome into the Truth Serum, everybody. Joey the Truth Wagner with you here. Uh, would really appreciate if you enjoyed this content, the post-game interviews, post-game press conferences after a crazy game between the New York Jets and the Denver Broncos in Broncos country. I feel so bad for you. Another loss with Russell Wilson and Sean Payton at the helm. Denver falling to 1-4 and four and losing to the Jets in Nathaniel Hackett. Ooh, so isn't it interesting in the preseason? Broncos head coach Sean Payton called out Nathaniel Hackett and how terrible of a job Nathaniel Hackett did last year as the head coach of the Denver Broncos. And he wasn't very good at all. That's why Hackett got fired. But this is why in this league, this is why you don't open your mouth in this league. Sean Payton opened his mouth, and Nathaniel Hackett and the Jets shut it for him. Nathaniel Hackett and the Jets beat Denver and the Trash Talk 31-21. As this is all the post-game thoughts, all the post-game reaction here from the Jets' side with Zach Wilson. So you see Nathaniel Hackett talking smack, chirping at the Denver sideline. For what Sean Payton said to him. Also getting reaction for you from the Broncos side with Sean Payton and Russell Wilson. Gosh, I hope a reporter asks Payton about his comments about Nathaniel Hackett. Would make it a thousand times better. But you know that's going to be a party tonight in that Jets locker room for Nathaniel Hackett. Oh, you gotta love it. Gotta, gotta love that celebration. And also, also too... Gotta give Zach Wilson credit. Second week in a row, he plays solid. I know he had the, the sort of ugly interception on the 50-50 ball late in the fourth quarter. But other than that, Zach Wilson, very efficient. 199 yards passing, only that one turnover. And he used his legs a little bit to scramble for 26 yards. Jets roster is stacked. If Wilson can just not lose them the game and play semi-confident, the Jets will be Okay, and that's what today showed. Back-to-back -back weeks of good performances for the Jets. Last week against the Chiefs and a close loss. Today in a win against Denver. If you liked all of this post-game reaction from both clubs, give us a like. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel as well. So long here from the Truth Serum. Week 5 of the NFL for the Jets and Denver.